Starting field position for South Carolina. Starnecki up, middle of the field is open, and there's Debo, and he's tackled inside the five. See two tight ends at the bottom of your screen, and Skarnekia will throw the fade, and it is caught. Brian Edwards, touchdown Gamecocks. Looks like number 11, physical finish to that catch. Roundtree shuffles his feet and is inside the 35. In the red zone. The zoo has three tight ends on a second and three, and Rocket is hit. After maybe a yard, it'll be third down. That's Shamik Blackshear got in there. Cox 0 for 3 on third down already, third and five. Skarnecki with a flag down. Debo makes some kind of crazy catch, and inside the 30-yard line, he's tackled near the 26. If it stands, it's 37 yards. Big one so far in this game. Tyson Williams inside the 20 as he is tripped up, but a nice positive play for nine yards on first down. Nate Anderson, the one that was allowed, what forced him to the ground. Williams, the junior from Sumter, South Carolina, started his career at North Carolina. You know, one of the things too, Taylor, short football field. This defense hasn't been on the field very long. The first real sustained drive for South Carolina. Skarnecki up, middle of the field is open to the goal line, touchdown! Brian Edwards again for 17 yards. This looks like what you saw a lot of last year, but it doesn't work. Albert O makes the catch. That was the thing with, with Locke that you saw the first three years, Stench, is a, a quick fake to the backfield, quick throw to your first option, go down the field as fast as possible. Beatty, whistled down at the four yard line. Javon Kinlaw credited with that tax room for 117 yards and two touchdowns. And the rain has really picked up in this one. As you see, Missouri with late substitutions, and they're going to get an opportunity to do so. Skarnecki up, will run it himself and dive out the 40-yard line. And Christian Holmes, who tried to deliver the hit, took the bigger blow between those two. Game and very similar field position scenario. Going for it on fourth down. Pumps, throws underneath to Edwards, first down. Thought about throwing to Rico Dowdle, who was covered up and instead finds Edwards underneath. Took the last second to deny the reception. Skarnekia, middle of the field to Samuel, touchdown Gamecocks. Continues to pour over Williams Bryce Stadium. Rocket, no place to go. Keir Thomas and company there to make the stop second down. The end zone, South Carolina's got almost the entire balance of the field to defend. Mizzou has to get to Lexington for a first down, and they go nowhere. Javon Kinlaw. Kick a field goal, and instead, Fatoni asked to try to pin South Carolina deep. And he drops it, picks it up, and is tackled back at the 47. It was a good snap from Drew Wise, but Fatoni could not handle it, and Bryson Allen Williams was there to make the tackle. What a remarkable turn of events for the Gamecocks. Come through. Those are tip, both of those underneath throws and runs after catch. Take to Williams, middle of the field is open, and that's Edwards to the 30. From 42. And that one is straight down the middle. The Gamecocks lead for the first time today. In his career, maybe a major misstep there. Third and 12. Lock trying to set up the bubble intercepted, picked off, and it's a touchdown. Sherrod Green.
It's almost as if whenever it rains harder, things go better for South Carolina. It starts raining, and all of a sudden, it's been all Gamecocks this half, certainly this quarter. Rain picks back up. Things start to go badly for the Missouri offense. They keep a season high, rather. Do they keep it on the ground on a third and three? No, instead, Locke will throw it to Albert. Oh, and he's tackled in the backfield for a loss. That's Stephen Montak with the airplane slide. Attacking the line of scrimmage with extra defenders. Sarnekia. Again, the strike to Edwards. Did he complete the catch? He did inside the 30 down at the 28. Almost came up with a turnover. Parker White has made one from 42 yards. And now he's got another, and the Gamecocks are back in front. Offense well so far this week. Middle of the field is wide open, and it's Kyle Markway. Markway down at the 27-yard line. Parker White from 33 yards, and the Gamecocks take the lead. That makes five lead changes. Kind of roll out the pocket. How far can Locke sling it from the 25? Incomplete. Gamecocks win. And one of the most dramatic wins you'll ever see at williams Bryce Stadium, South Carolina wins their 400th game in Columbia. It's kind of fitting that Brian Edwards, who started the game off, a couple of touchdown catches, key third down receptions, and he came over, as you see him limping, came over to break up that pass. For them, it's about finishing. For South Carolina, they got to get this run game going. Brown to pass, a quick slant, complete to Van. Josh Van all the way out to the 45, and he moves the sticks. Harris bounces it outside, has the first down and more, and finally pushed out of bounds at the 32-yard line. Kevin Harris. Brown has a man wide open out of the backfield. White on the move. White. Dynamite! Touchdown, South Carolina! Use in motion. Run a little counter. Nice move by White. Still going. The pack still moving inside the five. First and goal, Gamecocks. Wow! We got a fullback in. Out of the offset eye. Makes the catch and touchdown! And along came Jones, Trey Jones. A little blitz off the edge, picked up, and Zacondre White made a great move, cuts it back. On the loose! White finally knocked out of bounds inside the 30 by McCreary, but a big time catch and run. Pulls it out in the RPO. Brown on the move into the end zone. Touchdown! Van is the man! And the Gamecocks take the lead. Blitz coming. Finley sacked. Back at the 36. He never got a chance. Brad Johnson, the first one to arrive. For her today. Praying for you, Shelby. White breaks one off the right side. Got a nice block downfield. And he runs out of bounds at the 40-yard line. Josh Van, Robert. Hi, Kroger. We'll watch it bounce at about the 22. South Carolina going to down it. They're going to try and sell the officials on an Auburn player touching it, but does not appear that it was touched. 
The kick was touched by the receiving team. Wow. Wow. That is a wow. That is a stunning that result. Was, that was almost like an Instagram filter, you know? <laughs> sometimes you don't know just, what you're seeing. Sometimes you don't know what you're seeing. <laughs> I don't believe that ball touched no. uh, Simpson there, but the camera angle does make it look like it did. Brown takes a knee. Boy, what a great scene here. As Jason Brown is going to lead South Carolina to victory here tonight. Their sixth win of the season, and with it, bowl eligibility for first-year head coach Shane Beamer. Uh, Auburn. Here's Nix to the air on second and ten. Now he's going to take off, and... Will get sacked at the 21 yard line. There's Keir Thomas again. To the, the, the coach Saban is healthy, obviously, with uh, what's going on. And, and, and the dangers of COVID is Kevin Harris picks up the first down here on 20, uh, past the 25. On third and 11, Nick's in trouble. Escapes. Now Nick's throws into traffic, and it's intercepted. There's JC Horn again making a play. But it's the biggest story in college football today. Second and six. That pass is caught for a first down by Shai Smith. He hung on to that one after dropping a pass on the last drive that would have kept the possession going. Month with a hand injury. Hill dumps it off. Harris got the first down. Out of bounds at the three, but a fresh set of downs for South Carolina. Catch. A good conversion. Harris again, keeps the feet moving, driving, and is into the end zone for the touchdown. Third down and five. Nix from empty, moving around, flips it into traffic again, and it's picked off again. Intercepted by Jalen Dickerson. He's been targeted six times already, three catches. Hill. Looking for Smith, he's got it, a first down to the 35-yard line and a gain of 10. Who's a transfer from Colorado State. They're going to run behind him. Fenwick has a first down to the 23-yard line. Kevin Harris back in the game at running back. Hill, and the pass is caught by Van. Makes the defender miss. Van has a first down. It'll be first and goal from the two. Really fun to watch tonight. Quarterback keeper Hill on second and goal pushes his way toward the goal line and in for the touchdown. How about Harris finishing that run too? Here's the backup. Fenwick inside the 10. It'll be first and goal. South Carolina a chance to take the lead here on this possession. Goal outside the 10 now. Hill with a flag down. Oh, Shai Smith up the ladder pulls it in for touchdown. Based on what happened in the Arkansas game last week and how badly they got beat by Georgia. Here's a reverse on a trick play. And out of bounds to carry on Joyner. Snap to Nix. Sidearms it and it's picked off by J.C. Horn taking it back. With a second interception of the game, J.C. Horn. Excellent play on the ball. Kevin Harris running it left and running it in. Touchdown South Carolina. Big number 13. Four-man rush by Auburn. Here's a shot downfield, single coverage. Smith, oh, he caught it! One-handed, ripped it in. I'm sure I go play action, throw it deep. Instead, they just hand it off to Fenwick, but he gets the first down easily. They are starting to lean on that Auburn defensive line. From about 45 and in. And right on cue, puts it through. Nix, time is running out. A flag is down, and Nix running the ball. He's tackled at the nine. No time left. Let's see what the penalty is, though. This went down. Personal foul, hands to the face. Offense number 71. The ball carrier is short of the line of the game. That penalty is defined. A huge win for Will Muschamp and South Carolina beating number 15 Auburn.
White. In the backfield behind him is Brown is under center. And it's a flea flicker for Brown on the first play. And it's a completion out to the 30-yard line as Van makes the catch. And seven. Again, White looking for space, breaking tackles. First down, Gamecocks out past the 45. You know, Taylor, we're Harris, who was the leading rusher in the whole conference last year on the field. And it's a throw by Brown into Florida territory. It's the leading receiver, Josh Van, with his second. From the floor to 47. Straight ahead run past the 40. It's Harris for another Gamecocks first down. In front of Kevin Harris, the tailback on fourth and one. And he follows Jones for the easy first down up to the 25 yard line. How about the block from the 6-3-3 three for White? Dealing with it, moving from left to right, and he squeezes it in there. He's had an outstanding season, the fifth-year senior. His time at St. Francis knows what it takes to rally the troops. It's a Quandre White hitting the hole hard in a first down run, staying on his feet in the Gator territory. One man to beat, and he's tripped up at the 20-yard line. That was a touchdown-saving tackle. Team touchdowns out of their previous 25 trips. Brown is topside. It's Juju McDowell in the Wildcat. Touchdown, Gamecocks. It, it tied in. They're trying to get them more incorporated in the passing game. Harris. It's a first down run into Gator territory, and he's tri tripped up inside the 30-yard line. Tyron Hopper made the season kicking field goals and extra points. This from 35 yards, and it's right through there, and the Gamecocks are back on top. Receiver, well, that just gives you an idea how fired up Shane Beaver is to be here. Brown, under pressure, throws the deep ball. He's got a receiver, and it's caught! Inside the 30! What a catch by Josh Van! Brown steps up, fires across the middle, throws behind Van, who makes a good catch. Down chance to turn it up and pick up a first. King Cox just one of four on third down. Wild snap. Brown fields it. Right at the line to the end zone. Touchdown, Van. And he hooks it, but barely in there. And it's the third field goal for White in the first half. In the game. Back of your mind, you want to concede a takeaway. Just a minute left in the half. Jones in trouble again, gets out of there. Now will take off, there and he is. loses the football. It's up for grabs, and the Gamecocks got it. It's a touchdown for Jabari Ellis. It looked like Aaron Sterling punched it out. And Ellis was right there for the scoop and score. Salvage something with the last 34 seconds of this half. Malik Davis doesn't have much place to go. Sterling force a turnover and take a 20-point lead to the break. straight incompletions Lloyd to the ground and Marshawn Lloyd into Gator territory inside the 30 and a horse collar tackle is going to add 15 more Gamecocks lead is 23 over the Florida Gators 
with 8.04 to go in the third. To the From the Gators' own 32. Handoff. I don't think he got there. Damani Staley hit Pierce. Turnover on downs. Ooh. Kevin Harris hits the hole hard. Inside the 20, into the red zone again. So Quandre Wright follows Trey Jones. First down, Gamecocks. And Brown throws it over to Bell. Bell slips a tackle. Touchdown. back it's a nice throw I think it's part of him getting into rhythm on the option he gives it to Pierce Pierce has got no place to go he loses yardage Cam Smith and then Jordan Birch they fully expected to win that football game you always do but they felt really good about it and went the other way on him quickly Emory Jones throws and Cam Smith picks it off possession game Jones under pressure, sacked by Rush. Expected was what Georgia did to Missouri. Bad snap. Brown fields it though and still gets the first down. <laughs> to get dialed in physically. He lives right outside the stadium, by the way, in, in some apartments. And here is Harris. Now that's the guy we saw last season lead the SEC in rushing. Well, two of those three at home, right? So you go on the road at Mizzou. And with those final two at home here in williams Bryce, and just impose. It's up in. No. That's a guy that should be the starting quarterback the rest of the way. Pierce on what could be the last play of the game. Gets into Gamecock territory. South Carolina beats up on the Gators tonight. 40-17. to led by a fifth-year transfer quarterback that at a night he'll never forget. Were you asked to... Then goes through his progressions. Here comes a blitz. Cromwell protected. Now the pocket starts to collapse, and he gets back to the line of scrimmage. Kingsley and Igbari brought him down. Four. He's looking for a third-down conversion here. And he finds Edwards on a deep crossing route, a big third down conversion as Holinsky took a shot and Mom and Terry. most impressive part of it is There's a catch by Nick Muse. And he's got another first down for 50 success on this drive. Play action for Holinsky. He's going to take a deep shot down the sideline. He drops it in perfectly. Brian Edwards. That's a touchdown for the Gamecocks. Play action. Here comes the blitz. Long throw to the sideline. And he squeezes it through. Chavis Dawkins has a first down. And Holinsky. Who was ever looking for it. Ryan Holinsky, listen, no longer a freshman, right? He's not playing like one. Go Dowdle. Finds a cutback lane in the secondary. And he's got a game. Cox first down. And a gain of 13. Brought down by. It's got the distance. It's got the accuracy. How about that? A new career long for Parker White. In it. Crom slings one to the sideline, and it's intercepted by McQuabo. He's down the sideline. Long strides to the pylon for a pick six. from 53 and that's deflected that had nothing to do with the kicker being iced that had to do with that defensive front for South Carolina stopping Georgia before the gun 
And it is a seven. Georgia needs to anticipate something like that. There it is. Tavian Feaster into the secondary. Are you kidding me? He's got a first down. Dan, you called it before the snap if you're Georgia. Watch deep safeties and man-to-man -man and all the receivers. Yep. There's a screen to Van. He gets a block. He gets to the 50-yard line and makes it third Enjoy down and very manageable for some. Play action. From was looking downfield for the deep ball and could not find that open receiver again. Though on a march, plus the center exchange. It's on the deck and it's a giveaway by Georgia. A muffed center exchange for Jake Fromm's got the other quarterback up with a fist bump on the South Carolina sideline as T.J. Brunson found the loose ball. Not exactly where you want it, and that's a big deal. We saw it there. Joyner in trouble. Dodges tackles in the backfield, tucks it under, lowers his shoulders and gets the first down. Comes a blitz from outside. Reaching out to try and pick it off is McQuamu. He's got it. Second interception of the day for Israel McQuamu. Tipped ball. Intercepted. It's McQuamu again. And this one's down the middle. Blankenship from 42 to try and extend the game.